Hey guys, Tim from Father and Son Adventures of Iowa. I just want to do a little quick overview of a video camera that I got. Um, and this was, I, I went ahead and bought it based on a video that uh, Josh from Frog Tech here uh, Sanctuary uh, did. Um, and it's this uh, HD 4000 or LD 4000 um, light dow. HD camera. Um, I'll go ahead and open it up. I'm going to uh, just go over a few features that I've used this for the last week. Um, I attached, attached it to my semi truck and um, I'll roll some video in too um, to show you. But so far, very impressed um, for a uh, very inexpensive 40 some dollar camera. Um, lots of features packed in, um, still learning how to use it. Okay guys, so out of the box, um, this camera feels a little cheap, I mean, but what do you expect, it's 40 bucks and 40 some dollars. Um, up to a 32 gigabyte SD card, got a mini HD MI uh, port and a mini uh, USB port, and so you can hook that up for charging, um, came with a Came with a USB charger and an electrical uh, adapter. Um, I have yet to use the waterproof uh, camera part of it. Um, I'm excited to, to go try that. Um, it did come with this. Sorry, I'm trying to use my webcam. It did come with this uh, little box part right here, but. The window mount is something that I bought on Amazon for like $4. Um, anyway, but it's the, the thing that I liked about this box mount here uh, is that it's got the um, quarter inch, quarter 20 tap on both the bottom side for a uh, uh, tripod or uh, uh, selfie stick. And on the top side, which worked out great for this suction cup mounting. Um, the camera uh, defaults to video when you first turn it on. Um, and it's got a L LCD uh, screen and uh, that's something that you do not get with GoPro. Um, then I noticed that when you turn it off, um, I noticed that when you when you are doing video, um, well, when you first turn it on, it defaults to the video um, mode, which I think is really cool because that's the reason I bought this. Um, secondly, if you're going to video like the the driving down the road that's what I videotaped and I'll roll just a short little bit in um, uh, after so long maybe a minute um, the the screen on the back turns off to save power and it did come with two batteries it came with a whole bunch of adapters for other mounting uh, features and um, some of the other features of this camera and, and this isn't a full review but just an overview um, but it's a 12 megapixel camera it shoots video up to 30 frames per second um, it's got a car DVR mode it's got uh, uh, sequence mode which is I think uh, one minute three minutes and five minutes or something like that um, 
I've been trying to find a manual. So if any of you guys already know where there's a manual online, I'd appreciate you commenting or putting a link into a comment. Um, because there's a lot of features this has that I don't know how to use. Um, anyway, uh, my first impression of this camera is it's really cool. Um, I do I, I do like that it has the waterproof uh, box, and I'm really excited to uh, start using it. Um, I'll be using it for uh, as an A camera or a B camera. Um, in addition to my Canon Elf that I've been using for the last couple of years. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, put any comments below and uh, uh, please subscribe to my channel and thanks a lot.